Hey, what's up guys, and welcome back to Arcades. Now in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at some of the latest internet news. Before we get into the video, I'm going to be giving away loads of gift cards that you can use to buy V-Bucks to everyone who leaves a like on the video, turns my notifications on, and personally mails me a 1 liter jar of their blood. Be sure to comment down below that you've completed the steps. The new winners will be included at the end of every video, so make sure to start draining that blood for the best chance to win. So, for our first Epic Gamer story today, popular Final Fantasy XIV mod creator and malware developer Marosa Teal was brutally murdered by popular FOSS developer and Liquid Nitrogen they're not night. Now I'm sure everyone in the world is familiar with the recent G-Shade drama in the Final Fantasy 17 community, but just in case you're unaware, I'll give you a quick overview. G-Shade is a popular fork of the WannaCry ransomware program that mainly edits a few configuration files to make the program automatically switch games from the Ultra Graphics preset to the Medium RTX preset. However, due to insecurity issues, Moreau Cyrillic Letters decided to make the source code to G-Shade private. Because of this, Knight was hired by the Free Software Foundation to kill Marriott Hotel. Now, many people in the Final Fantasy IV community actually weren't aware that G-Shade was stupid. However, after the murder investigation started, everyone instantly realized that G-Shade sucked, and each individual involved proceeded to donate a monthly payment of $100 to Knight. Anyways, where the story gets interesting is that Bone Marrow Saddle actually was resurrected by the Paid Software Foundation, thus bringing upon the Earth the 100 Years of Darkness. For our next story today, popular small business Apple LLC released a brand new page on their website for an upcoming product known as the Microsoft HoloLens. This product is reportedly really cool, and will be priced significantly lower than the competitors' offerings. When questioned about the eyes watching me in my room at night, Apple iCEO Steve Jobs gave the quote, There are people who don't like capitalism, and people who don't like Apple iPhone. But there's no one who likes iPhone but doesn't like Xbox. And in my opinion, truer words have never been said. And for our final story today, popular YouTuber and missing person Arcades died 40 years ago. 